Tomorrow, people around the U.S. will gather to pay their respects to veterans. And Sal Carmona joins us this morning with more on the Veterans Day celebration in Harlingen. Welcome, Sal. Good morning, uh, Dan. Thank you. Thank you for being here. Now, you're part of the Harlingen Veterans Advisory Board. What's the organization's mission? Uh, the organization's mission is to uh, bring awareness to uh, veterans' needs, uh, not only in Harlingen, but in possibly throughout the valley. Uh, we have the uh, Veterans uh, Clinic here as well. And so we, we are to advise the city commission of any needs for, for veterans in, in Harlingen and the valley. And we have quite a few veterans that are living here in the valley, don't we? Uh, we have quite a few. And matter of fact, uh, the numbers are different because it deals with the, uh, the Valley Veterans Advisor Coastal Bend uh, uh, Clinic. And, and therefore, there's a lot of numbers coming in and a lot of numbers of people that have not reported and registered for themselves as veterans. So the number is not exact, but yes, we have okay. quite a few. Yes. Well, let's talk about what will be happening at the ceremony tomorrow. Tomorrow at, at 11 a.m. at the uh, Pendleton Parks uh, Veterans Memorial Park in Pendleton Park. Uh, we're going to start at 11 because it's traditional for the Veterans Day to be at 11. We'll uh, have a couple of guest speakers. Uh, we'll also have the uh, mayor there as well. And then more importantly, we're going to have uh, songs and uh, tribute to all veterans, uh, not only in Far Engine, but through the valley as well. And for those that haven't been to the park, it's a really cool place. I went on Flag Day. They had a special flag yes, there. Sir. But it's just a great monument to all our veterans, isn't it? Correct. Uh, family members can buy papers for their service member, uh, and it's uh, it's there. They don't have to be passed away. It's for the living veterans as well. Uh, you can buy a bench to tribute to your uh, service member, as well as just papers that are out that you have out there. You can have large ones with the logo for the service that they served in, and showing the time of service, just to say that you're proud of your veteran. Well, there it is. There's the time, 11 o'clock. And for those that don't know, give us a little bit of idea who else is going to be on hand tomorrow for the event. We'll have the uh, commanding officer for the Naval uh, Reserve Center here on off of Teague Street, uh, Lieutenant Commander Bosby. He'll be there, as well as, the, like I said, the mayor will be out there. But more importantly, we're going to have a, quite a few songs. We'll have the uh, Combined Color Guard showing all the flags of all service members. Uh, I think a lot of us, us, we've had a lot of comments at the flags we show for the uh, Merchant Marine as well as the POW and the Coast Guard. We include all the services out there, so everyone's proud. We'll have a uh, Armed Forces Melody song so every service member can stand up and sing their song uh, for their service. Uh, it's like today is a Marine Corps birthday, so all the Marines will be out there proud uh, for, for their service as well. Well, excellent, Sal. We appreciate you being here this morning, and good luck with the event tomorrow. All right. Well, thanks, sir. See you out there.